Hello friends, this is Papa, your Excel friend. Welcome to new video tutorial of Microsoft Excel. And uh, in our next three videos, we will discuss about how to work on multiple sheets. Multiple sheets at a time. Actually, suppose those are your employee, Asan Habib, Najmul Huda, Sayed Bashar, Pradeep Shil, Mustafa Ali, uh, uh, Mamun Sohel, Rajanur Rimon, and those are your employee and those are your salesmen. And you want to create the month wise uh, and what they are selling Samsung iPhone HTC and LG mobile phone they sell. So what is the sales statement a month wise salesman sales statement you would like to create month wise sales statement January to December. Okay. Then so uh, what the people do they create a chart like this then copy that and go to each test sheet and paste it this way they paste it. Isn't it? But you can do it. Suppose, first of all, I will delete all the sheets. This information of all the sheets together. See, all the sheets information already gone. How, what I did, Control G, just I have selected first sheet and then last sheet. How? Pressing Shift in my keyboard. I pressed Shift in my keyboard. Then just Shift here or here in my keyboard. Then I have selected, okay. first of all I have selected sheet 1, then press shift, then last sheet. All the sheets have been selected. Now I will select them, control minus to delete the rows, then all the sheets information already gone. So I have deleted all the sheets information just within a single click. Then I will input those information once again. Suppose okay, I will delete all of them. I have deleted. Then I will copy this, then I will select all of the sheets, sheet two to twelve, then I will paste here. See, in all the sheets, same information has been inputted. Suppose I will you I I will use a formula or function in all the sheets. In that case, what I need to do? I need to just to select first sheet and last sheet by pressing Shift in your keyboard. Press Shift and select the last sheet. All the sheets has been selected. Now. I will add here random data. That means I'm using any function. But if you are working in any organization, in that case, you will have to put the correct and accurate data. So think what I'm inserting, those are correct data. First of all, I will insert rent between 30,000, bottom 30,000, and maximum 80,000. Then after closing, as I will insert in all the sales, that means the total range at a time, in that case, what I will do, control, enter. See, same information, same command has been implemented in all the sales and even all the sheets. See, all the sheets. But the thing is, the sales value, uh, 56,009. Then 46,204. But uh, I, I want to make it round with 100. So, in that case, what I will do, I will select total them. Then I will add another function that is called ceiling. That means go to top, upper, 100 or 1000. I will make it 100. After close, that means it will be rounded with 100. But it, this command was not done in all the sheets because all the sheets was not selected. Now, pressing shift, I will hit last sheet. Then all the sheets has been selected. Now, if I press CL, CI, selling at the last 100, control enter. Now, all the sheets has been Say all the sheets. It has taken the data uh, in all the sheets. This way you can input the data, you can do, uh, you can uh, format, 
you can insert the data in multiple sheets. So in our next video, we will discuss about more about next uh, uh, two videos. We will discover uh, discuss about multiple sheets calculation. So until the next video, your friend will see you. Goodbye.